Yes, ma'am. You can give me personal checks from any state except for people from Charleston. It was always in the family for generations from the 16th century that they could think of, all the way back to Africa. It's considered as one of the oldest craft of African origin in America. It's the only basket of its kind, and it's only within the Charleston area, the Mount Pleasant area, that this tradition is still alive today. When our ancestors came from West Africa, they sold here in Charleston, they were placed it on Boone Hall Plantation, and uh, they were placed out there to do uh, plant and grow rice. And those that had different skills, uh, they were placed out in those slave quarters. The rice ran a basket, but the first basket that the slaves made to clean the rice because they didn't have tools. So uh, they used the saltwater material to make their basket in order to clean the rice. The sweet grass grows on islands near the saltwater. The bulrushes is the strong structure stuff, and it comes in different sizes. These are some of the thinner ones here, but they come much thicker than that to make the big baskets. Those grow right in the marsh. At the time, from the 16th century, developers, this mass work here of uh, developers taking over the Carolinas, especially in Mount Pleasant, where we were born and raised, is now the highest real estate area almost here in the United States. All the, everybody wants waterfront property. And this, these material grows on the waterfront, so they clear it all out. So that's eliminating the bulrushes and the sweetgrass, and even the palmetto trees. Okay, a quality basket, a basket that is very much so woven. It holds its forms. When a basket is made well, it's thoroughly woven. Every coil here when woven. There's no wrap. It's thoroughly woven. And then it once it's thoroughly woven, you can see it. You can feel it. A thoroughly woven basket, just the just the whole one in your hand, you can feel already the difference. Feel. It it it's 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 well made. It's strong. It's Solid. You can bounce it. I'm not into this for a money process. I love what I do. When I make a basket, I'm, part, I'm, I'm, I'm practically in the basket myself because I do this day and night. I, I just love doing baskets. With my basket, I want it to be a basket that keeps its, its styles and shape for generations. I don't want it to be like it falling apart Later on, once you get it home, you're thinking what you purchase is, oh, that's how it looks now. And then when you get home later, it's nothing what you think it is. I want that basket to be from the day you purchase it. I want it to be like wine. I want it to be the more it aged, the better my basket gets.